stamps from that texture. Maybe like one that had some really deep pivots in it, or divots in it. And then one that was lighter, so that you could have two or three, and as you're doing it, kind of turn them a little bit. So that it, and I'm not really a stamp master, but no. that's how we would do it. And talk really quickly about, about the, we have a piece of the Komodo cane, and there are these Komodo dragons on it. And so you get to a level of scales, you can't really recreate Komodo Even dragon scales. Even on a full size Komodo dragon, the scales are microscopic. So then if you shrink it down to this size, you're really doing almost symbols of scales. Yeah, the point is you can't sculpt those scales. It's just impossible. I and mean, people wouldn't see it. You're doing some a kind of illusion of it. Mm -hmm. A representation, yeah. I would say. Um, and texture is just, again, it's the little bitty bits that don't seem like they would ever matter. And you can barely see them on your finger. But then as you do hundreds of them and you step back, it's like, oh yeah, that does kind of. With hair and fur, I would say, don't get trapped into trying to do the little lines. Exactly. Do more of a blocks. Yeah. And, and, uh, and you can go in and put like couple little pieces, but a lot of it is more about the form of what the hair is doing. A lot of people want all these separate strands. We did that on the Dow Peel, our first yeah. piece ever. You know, it's all these little bitty lines and, you know, trying to sculpt the lines and hair. And really, it doesn't come out very realistic looking. It's better to just do the intimated kind yeah, of Yeah, the shape of it. Mm -hmm. the form. Anything else? And we thank yeah, you all for just coming. Just real fast, when I... I a friend of mine was telling me like, sometimes you use wax paper uh, to, to get uh, textures. Right. Mm -hmm. uh, I never really asked him exactly how we could do that, but I guess you know probably yeah. just crinkle the crap out of it and just kind of push right. it in there. And I've heard aluminum foil. Somebody told me that this yeah. last year. For, it's a, it just an idea. I like to I like the idea of organic stuff for organic things. If it's a, like a dragon. Like Jerry was saying, a dog's paw or an orange or something that has a, an organic feel to it. That's what I like. Um, if you start looking around, there's all kinds of you know, interesting things. Uh, like the, the dog's paw, where it starts to go and get really weird on the edge, you know. Yeah. It's a good spot. All right, man. We appreciate y'all coming. And we're, we're our booth is right at the entrance. If you haven't seen us into the entrance to the left, we've got a lot of pieces to look at. Thank you all. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.